In today's video, we're going to show you how to add a subscription form into WordPress using Elementor's website builder. That way you can take advantage of getting new subscribers inside of WordPress site. Let's get started with this tutorial right now. Welcome to Jock Forum. My name is George and this is SaaS Master. Today we're going to get started with this tutorial. I'm going to show you how to add a subscription form inside of a WordPress site that uses Elementor as the website builder. So in this case, let's get started by creating the subscription form. So let's go into create form. In this case, we'll start from scratch. We're going to select classic form. And let's add the basic elements to this. So let's go ahead and click on plus elements. We are going to ask for the name, the email, and we're going to keep it simple. Let's go ahead and get rid of this space. Let's smush this a little bit more so it's a little bit more compact. So let's go into the settings, advance, and we're going to shrink it. And we're going to do the same thing for the other element. So let's go ahead and shrink it. There we go. So we're going to keep it simple, clean. Okay, now that it's a bit more compact, let's go ahead and embed this on our Elementor site. So let's grab the code. Let's go into publish, embed, and we're going to grab this script right here. So let's go ahead and copy the code and let's head on over to our WordPress site that has Elementor. In this WordPress site, we already have Elementor installed. If you haven't installed this plugin, go ahead and go into plugins, add new, search for Elementor. There we go install it and activate it in this case it's already activated and we have it right here so let's go into one of our pages in this case we'll go into this home and we're going to edit with elementor here we go now this is just a demo site and what you have to do to embed this on a section that you would like is by clicking over the plus button and select one of the structures here so for example we can click click on one of the uh, main structures so that's a complete structure click on the plus button and we're going to search for html now there we go let's go ahead and drag it in here and now it opened up the html code section so let's paste the code that we grabbed from dot form and it should be ready now so let's go ahead and preview this really quickly let's publish let's have a look and here it is here's that section you can see how easy that was to embed your subscription form inside of an Elementor WordPress site. Now, can we customize this form even more? Yes, we can, so it can blend into your page. In this case, we don't have a template loaded, but if we did, if it had a white background, a black background, we want our form to be more into that same branding that we are using on the website that's using Elementor. For that, there's more settings on the form. Let's go into build. And in this case, we can do our form designer. So for example, we can change the page color, the form color, and we can play around with these just to show you how that looks. So for example, if the background of the page was um, black, we would use this and we would change the font color to something that would pop out. Okay. So for example, there we go. And it's a little bit more customized and that way we can embed that into our Elementor site that looks more similar. Now, can we do more with this? Yes, we can. We can go into style. We can scroll down, we can go into advanced designer and we can customize more of this form to our liking. So there's more settings in here in the advanced designer. So for example, the background image, the form layout, the form cover, form options, label styles, line spacing, etc. All of this can be changed to make it more customized. You can see these options. We don't have them on the normal designer, but we do have them in the advanced designer. We can move the buttons. We can change the colors for the buttons, the color schemes inside of here. So if I select the button, we have options for the background color for this and make it more customized. But there you go. That is how you are going to embed your subscription form inside of a WordPress site that's using Elementor as the website builder. We thank you all for watching and we'll see you on our next tutorials.